The weather reports suggest that there is a tornado which is hitting US and Canada in the month of August. Well, this tornado is a little different because it might just have a little positive impact on everyone's lives. Well, what can I say? 715 songs in Hindi, 189 in Telugu, some 47 in Malayalam, 120 in Bengali, 127 in Tamil. Well, the record is limitless. Not only this, five Filmfare Awards, seven Filmfare South Awards, four national awards and three state awards. So let's meet the superhuman Shreya Ghoshal sitting with us in the studio. You are literally a superhuman. So many languages, so many songs. I don't know how have you done that. Thank you firstly for this beautiful introduction and uh, well, there is nothing like superhuman in this. I think it's just a journey where I've had so much fun doing uh, what I like doing the most, sing. And since I'm in an, in an industry which offers so much of variety, I think not a single day goes where I say that, oh, I'm bored. There is not one moment. Every day, hopping from studio to studio, it's one Hindi song, one uh, Telugu, or one Kannada, one, you know, Jabi, or whatever. There is so much of genre, so many variety of styles of songs. So it, it's not about being superhuman. I think I've been very lucky to have got good songs, good composers, and they've had faith in me that I could deliver in all these languages. And these challenges I've taken up with a lot of fun, and I've had a blast. <laughs> Tell me something, do you actually speak so many languages or it's just that you mug them up? No, 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 I can't speak none of these. I mean, I can speak my mother tongue, Bengali, of course, uh, Hindi, English, that's it. Uh, but yeah, when I have the script in front of me, then it's no problem, you know, it's just that. <laughs> Aku, what time lagta hoga because to get the enunciation, pronunciations right and you know, everything correct about that language, um, kitna time lag jata hai sab See, mein. even, eventually you get the hang of the language, even though you don't uh, know the words by heart like that, but you know, like, every language has a particular style of accent or, you know, ek lehza hota hai. Yeah. So, uh, over the time, I've uh, kind of uh, understood that, so it doesn't take much time. In fact, certain words I know myself that okay this must be meaning that and the good thing is that all the Indian languages except Tamil or a few of them they are all they have a single root which is Sanskrit so mm -hmm. a lot of uh, words you know what they mean and of course there has been the help of the producers directors composers lyricists your Hathi Puri team if I go wrong they correct me so so far I've not made too many mistakes <laughs> been doing a lot of concerts. I'm sure these places, US and Canada, are your favorite because you're going there for the fifth time. People must really love you to call you again and again. Uh, I must uh, say, I must confess that US and Canada has one of the best audiences. It's so much fun to sing uh, for, uh, you know, the Asian communities which is settled there in uh, US or Canada. So much of warmth, so much of love, so much of excitement, anticipation and they wait all the year uh, round just for that next tour coming up and they come up in so many numbers and so much of love comes by. I feel very honoured, very privileged, very lucky that uh, I'm in a profession which can bind so many hearts together just with music. So what should the audience look forward to this time from Shreya? Like what's special, what is a special thing that is coming along with Shreya this time? I think every passing year there are uh, 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 pent up songs, you know. The songs get piled up. The ones which uh, released in the, uh, uh, since 2013, mm -hmm. my last tour. All those new songs are already 
uh, for the you know in uh, it's in the playlist so we are all set to sing those songs whether it's sun raha hai na tu or whether it's nagara sang dhol baje you know all those newer releases that are part i know that uh, the audience in us canada have a certain sensitivity to good music and especially when it comes to the older melodies so there's always uh, a little you know segment which i keep as a surprise sure so kis type ki preparations aap karte hain jab aap koi concert karne jaate hain to matlab kitne din lagte hain aapko preparations karne mein music preparation happens with rehearsals of the band mm-hmm. changing a little rearrangement of the songs and what is going to be the playlist after ek gaane ke baad kya medleys kya honi chahiye mm-hmm. naye gaane suggestions so we we take a couple of months uh, mm-hmm. especially the month before we leave for the tour that's the time when we start preparing i think it's wonderful to be a part of this high energy high impact stuff so that's all i mean what do you fun. prefer playback singing or concerts oh they are two completely, completely different, different things and i love both must say live concerts it is a different high लाइट्स इतनी होती हैं कि आपको ऑडियंस पूरी तरह से दिखती नहीं है बट यू कैन हियर देम यू नो द एनर्जी ऑफ दैट ऑडियंस यू नो वेर आई हैव टू डू वॉट आई डिड माई फर्स्ट कॉन्सर्ट प्रॉबेबली वेन आफ्टर देवदास रिलीज दैट वॉज ईयर्स बैक सिंस देन एवरी कॉन्सर्ट हैज बीन अ लर्निंग एक्सपीरियंस एंड ओवर द टाइम आई हैव रियली अंडरस्टूड हाउ टू रीड द माइंड ऑफ ईच एंड एवरी पर्सन हुज सिटिंग देर इट्स फन इट्स इट्स it's almost like an art and when it comes to recording it's a, i think it's a very spiritual experience what i do in the studio creating something out of nothing that creation itself it feels like uh, you're giving birth to a baby it's almost like that mm-hmm. so it's it's a very spiritual experience <laughs> about your first concert how nervous were you or how excited were you mm, can't even remember those days now it's so long back of course i was damn nervous even though i started very early in my life i started uh, as a contestant in saregama mm-hmm. those days were when i was 10 years 11 years old but i never did a full fledged concert till after my first film released mm-hmm. that was a very thought of uh, decision from my father especially that he didn't really want me to you know exploit my voice or overuse my voice through concerts or mm-hmm. anything it was very well taken care of that way so when i was a kid i think first few years though i was just getting the hang of it mm-hmm. i was very naive on the stage it was more about just singing nothing more than that i was so nervous <laughs> is there any particular concert that you actually remember that something had happened over there like recently i did a, a concert in the royal albert hall in uk uh-huh. i would say that uh, the the energy was something else i had goosebumps throughout and especially when those are the songs which i love singing especially when say i am singing a song like lag ja gale which is one of my most favorite songs mm-hmm. apart from my own songs there are some songs which i have a connection nostalgic connection to and melodic connection to those just it can actually i sometimes control myself i can start crying it can happen <laughs> can i hear you singing the same song oh sure of course that that is i think my audience knows that this is one of my most favorite old song of lata ji of course she's my inspiration i do lag ja gale ke phir ye hansi raat ho na ho shayad phir is janam me mula have goosebumps like <laughs> literally it's beautiful thank you when did you actually realize that you could 
sing so well or were you pushed in that direction or it was your decision i mean you were very young no, when you i think it was never because i as as you know that i started very young yeah. and it was solely my parents especially my dad i inherited music from my mother my uh -huh. mom's side and maternal side but even though my dad is more of an academician and an engineer with you know more of a scientist but i think his brain which <laughs> the right hand side of the brain the creative side music art he loves all of that so he has basically been my motivation into doing everything that i've done bhure bhure badal bhiga bhiga jangal nila nila pani shami hai suhani bhure bhure badal bhiga bhiga jangal शामी है सुहानी कहा गुम हो यारा कह दो हाले दिल सारा कहा गुम हो यारा कह दो हाले दिल सारा ऐसे रत फिर आएगी दोबारा ऑन दिस नोट आई थिंक वी आर जस्ट गोना टेक अ लिटिल ब्रेक बट वी विल बी बैक सो डोंट यू गो एनीवेयर आई गिव दैट ऑडिशन इन अ वेरी घर में बनाया हुआ कराओके में कैसेट बनाई एंड वी जस्ट सेंट इट आई डोंट नो हाउ इट गॉट सेलेक्टेड 